previously on Mincraft. What I want to do is I want to make sort of an underground metro type of thing. So it's like you just clear it out a bunch. And uh, I'm going to be covering, I'm going to be building it out of wood. Take out some of the dirt. Going to have to take it out eventually. Man, it's crazy how an efficiency shovel just burns through everything. This looks pretty good. I like this. Once I get it all the way uh, done, all the way there, it's going to be sort of like a metro system. Going to help me get around to where I need to go and everything. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to Minceraft. I love how we start it, like, right in the middle as it's turning to nighttime. Matt! Where'd you go? Matt! <laughs> I'm not even kidding. What the fuck? We've been robbed! No. No. We've been robbed! Dude! Someone took our stuff! Actually, it was me. I built the chest for Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so genuine, everyone. So genuine. Exactly. And absolutely no acting. Everybody. Excellent, excellent. What what's the prize that they get? I graduated an, an from Oscar? the city of Juilliard. <laughs> I don't know. That's a reference to something. I have no, no fucking idea what it is. Juilliard is a famous acting school. Ah, All right, let's go, okay. let's go show you the chess room. Well, hold on, hold on. I want to show off that this, oh! guy, this guy figured out how to get out, so I just like boxed him in. It looks like he's in a little rocket ship. <laughs> it's kind of true. Like, it looks like one of those pod. pods from uh, Halo. Dude. The drop. Yeah, exactly. Could you imagine if like that's what this was? It was a job. Just another one slammed right into him. Has like mark. That would be awesome. That would be freaking cool. Yeah. So they look like certificates, but they have like little green, the green antennas and the green. Yeah, but imagine this guy. He dropped he dropped pods in, but his thing isn't like it couldn't ex it didn't set off. It didn't go off. So it didn't like, go off. So he's just six. sitting there. Help me. He's still in the chamber. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And it's soundproof, so he can't so hear his cries for help. My foot. <laughs> uh, All right, let's go. Good. Yep, let's check it out. Uh, I just want to show off the metro station we're gonna be taking to Zach's house that I built in the last episode. Mm -hmm. Um, I actually did a lot of stuff to it since then. I added in this little thing: push button to make cart, and the go button. And uh, there's no other. Oh, there's a cart there. Yeah, that's pretty Two. much it. I restocked it just for you. Thank you. And I made all of this go up to his place without him knowing, by the way. So I had no yeah. idea if he was going to be okay with it. I was like, man, it's going to be Well, fun. I like it. What happened? What happened? What happened? Yeah, you, you, that's one of your problems that are in it, too. No, 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 no. What's up? Uphill doesn't glitch? work. Did you glitch through? Oh, the uphill doesn't work. No way. Because this is the only time I've ever had that problem. I well, just fell through. You literally, I literally just fell through. Oh, because there's, no, there's a Oh, hole. what the fuck happened? I didn't do that. <laughs> Uphill doesn't work my ass. Here, put make sure make sure I, I got a grass block to make it look look party. I'll have a ch I don't have a thing. There you go. I have a powered rail. Here. There you go. Yeah. So you broke that, you son of a bitch. I didn't break it! So Honestly, weird. I didn't break it. It wasn't a creeper, there'd be a lot more damage. And Thanks. I don't think fucking Will just came in and just broke it. You don't have a stop here, though. You kind of just go up. Oh, well, I did have a stop here. I don't know what happened to it, honestly. I came back, and, like, there was a hole in the floor here, and all this track was missing. I'm like, was am I a werewolf? Like, <laughs> all anyway, right. Open the door. Plux. I really like that. Dart did that for you. I want to learn how to do something like that. That's like, a lot of redstone, and then we that. finish this. Cool. Dust room I made. How do you How do you paint stuff on? Uh, you just right-click the item. Really? Like, if I have an apple, you just right-click it. That's cool. Right-click the item frame. And then you can right-click it again and change yeah, the... Yeah. Can change the orientation, that's great. Whee! Wow. And then you break it. How do you get up. to the second floor? Like, okay, there's a ladder. I was about to say, like, I can't, I can't right-click that high. <laughs> Potatoes? Old... When were this in Minecraft? A long time ago. What the fuck? They're dropped by zombies, so are carrots. God damn it. You missed all. Right. Uh, yep, yeah, mm -hmm. missed a little bit. This is cool. We got glowstone and everything. So this is like our shared room and everything. And then I'm going to push this back and put like a furnace wall here. Like it's going to be a giant wall of furnaces. Furni? Nice. Uh, one, two, three. Because you can reach all the way to the tippy top. See? Tippy top? Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Is that... Is that a... For efficiency pick? That's why you just clicked it a little bit and it exploded? Yeah. Okay, I was wondering. It's like, why are you breaking that block? Oh, uh, you picked up one of the blocks. Fucking but anyway, <laughs> uh, I'm just going to do a giant wall of furnaces. That's cool. And then, Ima imagine if we make all of them double pistons so that just the wall retracts and 
That'd be impossible. You couldn't do that. Yeah, I know. Yeah. But it would be cool, though. Cool. And then I'm thinking about uh, uh, kind of putting something right here with, like, maybe, like, a, an anvil with, like, an ender chest. Like, an anvil, and then on top of it, an ender chest, so it's, like, double use, and it looks like it's uh, mounted. Yeah, and we don't even need, like, like uh, what's it called? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I messed up. Accidentally. Wow, you just right-click it once and it pops off? Yep, left-click it. You attack it. Oh, okay. I thought you actually had to like break. No, it's like in case of uh, emergency, break glass. Oh. <laughs> so you could we could put that around the base with water buckets in it, in case of fire, break glass. That's cool. <laughs> That's cool. I like, like that. Like break it and you get water bucket and you can quickly. Don't hit me. <laughs> didn't hit you. The bone hit you. Well, I'm gonna. Uh, I have actually. I found a thing on the Minecraft wiki where it's it gave their best option for sorting things out. Mm -hmm. It's like nature, rocks, ore, and different stuff like that. And I was like, oh, I like that. And then I was going to adapt it to the newer updates. Cool. So it's going to be it's going to be top, bottom, top, bottom, not left, right, or right, left. Like, no, this, it's top, This bottom, one top. isn't going to show it's in this chest. Well, because that wouldn't work if it's left, right, left, right, and yeah, this. Yes, exactly. So top, yeah. bottom, top, bottom would, makes more sense, yeah, I think. It just makes, yeah. So um, I really like this room. Yep. How, how long did you do this? Like, Because I'd, uh, I'd be on, I I'd be on Minecraft episode. and I, I wouldn't see you at all. I, I carved it out, kind of, in one episode. And I like I laid the basic design right here. And then I pretty much showed me... I, 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 in the episode, I pretty much I took all the chests and moved them over. And then I put this side in here because it was just this wall. And I was like, ah, it needs a little more. And then I put it in here because this is actually two blocks bigger this way and two blocks bigger that way. So Cool. And all of that's over there on uh, your own channel? Yep. Well, how about that? You can check that out if you want me to <laughs> show you a good design on how to build that because it's actually not difficult at all. Mm -hmm. awesome. A lot of stairs. A lot of stairs. Yeah. By the way, I used all, a bunch of your powered rails in my... Yeah, I can make rail. more. Exactly. We got a decent but, amount of gold. But an idea I had, I don't like this. We're going to get rid of the spiral up, by the way. So Just how are we going to make it? What we're going to do... Is this is gonna go? We're gonna recess the. Yeah, it's gonna, it is. It is. Remember I, it is nauseating. Come up, come up, come up. So remember how this is gonna be an Ender Pearl elevator? Yep. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna lower this more, because you can have it a maximum of 31 blocks, because the Ender Pearl goes 32 high. Okay. So we're gonna lower it down. And if it's if it's but past 31, we can't do it. But we're gonna lower it down with the Metro Rail and make it like a station, and we'll okay. build it kind of like the stations at my in the Nether Hub the thing. We'll have like a, a circuit track where we just push the button and it, we can stop here if we want to go to the base and stuff like that because it, it shouldn't be too deep, I think. Hmm. Like, let me, let me, I got waypoints. Let me set a waypoint and see how deep it is. I right. have no idea what you're talking about. Waypoints. I, uh, this is. Like, like with, with, with like, uh, I'm trying, I'm, I'm trying to think of like what you're talking about. It's like you, you had the new, the, the, the new nether hub area. Yeah, yeah. Remember how I made my track? Yeah. Uh, it's like a checkpoint system, pretty much. Like it's mm -hmm. like a station. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what we. I want to do here. Oh, for the whole metro station. Yeah. Yeah, that's actually what I had in mind at first. I was thinking like you call a cart and it sends one down, and it's like it's like an actual metro station where you have to go wait the next stop, and it sends you on the next one. Oh wow, it's only like five blocks taller. Yeah, exactly. I actually dug into the redstone, <laughs> the redstone area where okay. you were. Okay. Uh... Then I'm gonna put the cart back. I want to see how high. The actual thing would be if it's at the very tippy top. Um, of your little spiral staircase. Yeah, I what think it's your like spiral staircase have to do with anything, by the way. Like you okay. mean? Let you me mean, show you. you. Let me show oh, you. Let me show oh, you. Oh, you mean the minecart's gonna show up at the at, at your uh, at the at bottom the bottom? Okay, as a, yeah, as yeah, a yeah, point, yeah, yeah. And then you get out, and then you press the button for an ender pearl, and then yeah. ender pearl straight up. Yeah, makes sense. And then I'll have something right next to it. So from the very tippy top, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Oh, dude, we got plenty of room. Cool. We got plenty. So. I hope you didn't count each half slab as one. No, 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 no. It's <laughs> every two. Yeah, exactly. I know. Oh, well, I have a checkpoint down there, so exactly. I just stand right here and see how high it is. Like, holy shit, have... 87 blocks. How high up are we? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> it's like you're, you're walking upstairs. You're like, man, this is a lot of blocks. I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, and then I was going to build something next to it where it's like it drops down. Like into the water instead of because it's only one way the Ender Pearl elevator. Yeah. So, you would walk off and then if you want to do your thing and then go back down, you fall down the water pit. Speaking of Cut. that, we really we really need to get working on the Ender Farm. Well, yeah. we have to wait till 
XRPM Ryan gets back from Holiday, and we're going to get everyone to kill the Ender Dragon. Oh, cool. Me and Dard. Dard already has it uh, set up. Me, me and him have been working on it before. Oh, I actually so saw we that. Actually yeah, saw that once. Like, yeah. We actually have something. We actually have something. It's just it's kind it, of it's hard down... when you can't get back, and you still have a dragon fighting you. Exactly. I mean, the Ender, per ender chests help with that, but... Yeah, so. but it's it's we're 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 gonna get everyone in the server to kill. See, look at this fucker. You see him? You see him trying to get out? Yeah, they're, getting so smarter, they're learning. They're learning. They're getting smarter. Oh Back. god. Back. <laughs> Back. Uh, I'm actually gonna pick up this anvil. Get off, fucker. Cool. Okay, and by the way, what are we got? What are we gonna do with the zombie spawner in the? Oh, uh, we're, we're gonna make it a station. We're gonna make it another station to go oh, to the zombie farm. Right? That's gonna be freaking. That's gonna be long. Well, not long, but far away. It shouldn't be too far. I mean, it's it's mostly just tunnels we're digging. Oh fuck. Yeah, but uh, my idea for um, a day night sensor is one thing I noticed is that, dude, you notice how this door is backwards? Yeah. Well, that's actually forwards for me because that's how I put my doors. No, this door is backwards because normally it's like supposed to be like this going into the house. It's programmed to be like that, so when it hits nighttime, all of the t all of the testificates rush to get through. Oh, the that's door. how I just put my doors. I didn't know that's backwards. Yeah, that's backwards. All of the door, all of the oh, testificates. I'm backwards, rush, guys. And they start they start crowding around here, and like they're all just like standing there trying to get through the door. And if a day night sensor would be like if all the pressure the uh, yeah that's what uh, that's what people do. That's what they used to do for day night sensors. I thought they used, like, grass. No, that's another way, but the villagers is, like, a simpler method, but it, it's very faulty because they might be retarded and not go through the door. Oh, okay. Um, but uh, right. they literally have a block coming out, though, for a day-night sensor. Yeah, 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 you're telling and me that's, about that. And that's going to be a very, very soon update. Mm -hmm. I'm really excited for that. Like, you said it's a so redstone don't really update. How many one? new redstone shit is there? Uh, there's actually a redstone block. A block of redstone now, like you craft a nine, like same thing. And it's just but like it, red it gives red. off power. It's like a torch, but you can move it with a piston. That's cool. <laughs> yeah. Dude, oh my god, Dart is gonna have a field day when that patch comes out. Yep. Seriously, that's great. Yep. That's awesome. Okay. So, all right, we're gonna redesign this now. Yeah. Uh, you said that you wanted to do some redesigning on the on the metro station. Uh, I guess we could. Mm -hmm. Um, I mean, there's like... Because one thing that we could do is we could make it just all, like, really longer. Like, like you know how it's only, like, two blocks and then it goes to the thing? Well, well, what we can do is... This is definitely not wide enough and big enough. This is just way too tiny. It's too itsy bitsy. Too itsy bitsy. You want to have, uh, it like, like, darts where it's, like, wide open and spiral-ass place? God. Uh, no, it. not that. Uh, what I want to do is, um... Well, I like this open room kind of thing. Make it look like a waiting room, even we could decorate it up. Uh, but we're gonna—I kind of want to make it look like an actual subway, like you would see in a city, where like it's actually like down and stuff, and like mm -hmm. it, it would be like the end, would like loop around and come back, and then it stops and stuff like that. But I want to make it like lower and make it a little risen. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but would this be the last stop? And you know, how, like how you're saying how it loops at the end and everything. If this wouldn't be the last stop, well, I mean. What we, we could do, do is, like is uh, we could make two tracks. We could make two tracks, and there's a little bridge that goes over to the other side that you use to get onto the second track that goes in the opposite direction. You know what I wish we could do? What's was that? like long range redstone, because like you could push a button somehow that says, I want to go to this place, but like it's way past all these other stations, and like long range redstone would tell it to switch the track so it'll keep you going. So like it'll take you go past all those other things, and then it'll stop you. But then like. You, like, you come back and stuff, and then you hit, like, a shorter place, and it tells you which one. So it's like, you know what I mean? Like, it switches the track from a long way away. Wouldn't wouldn't that be like you would like use, like, a sensor rail with just a lot of redstone? No, because, like like I said, redstone only goes so far, and we'd have to, like, get a lot of redstone. And... Well, the thing is, it doesn't only go so far. It goes forever if you have, a, like, enough repeaters. But, but then the, thing the thing delay is, is so long. The delay is a little bit, but it's not as much as, like... Like you'd be, I think, I think the redstone would be able to keep up with a, um, a cart just fine. I'm just yeah. saying, if you really want to do that, we can, we can do that. Is it's always an option. Yeah. But anyway, uh, I'm we could just have it. Trim the edges. And immediately <laughs> it looks we could just have it a giant loop, and then we could probably change it up later in the future because we're only gonna have like one, two stops maybe so far, three stops or so. Exactly. So, like, we could just do it one giant loop like it is in another hub. 
But um, I don't know. So, I guess we're gonna have to debate on this for a while, guys. Exactly. It was like like. I first want to like sort of get some points of interest done that we could transport to. It's like okay, let's make a transportation system to the places that we don't actually have. Yeah. You know. So I think let's uh, we should start making some areas. Like I kind of want to work on the zombie dropper. Because <laughs> what happened? I was like, I was. <laughs> you know what I did? I was like, we don't have many points of interest. I'm gonna make a point of interest. Make a metro station. Fuck. <laughs> Where is it gonna go? What I kind of want to do with the zombie. Of interest. What I kind of want to do with the zombie spawner, by the way. Yeah. Um, because they know they have to fall twenty-four blocks. Yeah. It's over here. It's over uh, there. Are you sure? Are you sure? It's right here. Oh, okay. Wow, this is actually really close. I thought it was past my house. No, 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 no. It's right here. Um, since it's like really like, it's it's like kind of like not. It's it's kind of high. I, th I figured it was gonna be a lot lower. But um. Like I kind of want this to. Yeah, this uh, is, like it's, it's, I kind of want to push them, have them fall down a little bit, and then have them go up the twenty-four that we want them to fall. Mm -hmm. But like, kind of don't have the twenty-four sticking out of the roof because twenty-four is actually really high. Yeah, it is. So how about we just not let them fall and have like a like a um, uh, like what we have? Uh, it's just a um, a crusher. Like a. Well, then we have to build like a timer and stuff like that, and it's a lot different to. I think uh, that would look better and be more compact. I mean, like you said, well, 24 blocks is a long way. Dropper is better because I think um, it's more reliable. It is more reliable, but I find it like just a little punch. Well, well, like think of it like this. Where are you at? What's up? All right. So think of it like this. So this is a zombie spawner, right? Mm -hmm. This is a zombie spawner. What we could do is push them down like a couple blocks. Like let's say we have them drop right here so they don't take any damage. And then, like, when they fall down to that, we have the elevator going up the 24 to only there. See what I mean? Oh, yeah. And then we have them drop the 24, so they're only really dropping to here. So they're going down, like, stairs. They go down stairs at first. Just like they, go down, they go down, like, a little water elevator stairs. Because yeah. we, we can move the spawner, because it's a wide range. Mm -hmm. So that's what also, I was kind of thinking, kind of like snaking. The crushing system would be faster, I think, because you wouldn't have all this up and down. It would just be, it would just be that you flow them into one area and then crush them. This, well, this would be like you know the timing thing. on the crusher? Are you going to spend the time trying to figure out the timing? I'm sure it wouldn't take that long. Just keep adding repeaters until it kills them and then take one off. I guess. But it would be that hard. Some have, well, they have armor too, that's one thing. Oh, does that affect fucking I think it does, yeah. I don't, I don't think so. They're still not a one hit. They're never going to be a one hit because they have armor. Of course. So. So you're not, no matter what, no matter what, my way or your way, we're not going to be able to one hit them. So. That's why I want to get a brewing station too. Like, we have so much to do. Yeah, there's actually like a shit ton of stuff that we need to do. And we're just sitting here looking out over all our unfinished stuff. I, I guess we could just call this tree. episode Blueprints 101. Blueprints 101. I think I'm going to burn my treehouse down. Nah, I'm just gonna... Really? No, 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 no. What I'm gonna do I is don't I'm know gonna what you're going... Where are you going with that? I'm going to I'm gonna get a bunch of leaves, and I'm going to make it look like a tree. Like. Did you grow that tree to, like for reference? Huh? <laughs> I just noticed that. That's, that's what like... a tree looks like. What you've got? Uh... <laughs> yeah. I need a lot of fucking leaves, dude. Seriously. Like, where I need... like. Because the thing is, I'm going to make it, like, really, really poofy. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make it look like... Uh, like, like that one, tree? Like one of those skinny-ass trees over there. <laughs> I mean, it's going to look like kind of like that tree, but that's the tip. Yeah. Just the tip. Just the tip. Just the tip. Anyway, guys. <laughs> that's been right. Blueprints 101. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, hope you all enjoyed this episode of Minstraff. Probably, uh, probably not a very lot of exciting. new stuff. Not, not very actually, exciting. probably not. There's a lot of new stuff that they you guys probably saw. I mean, I actually saw a lot of new stuff, too. I didn't know... I didn't know Zach did his, uh... Now I need to do the expansive... Like, have you seen, like, the chest, how unorganized they are? Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. But oh yeah, my the, the whole storage area, I didn't know about that before I started this episode. And, um... Well, I knew about it, I just hadn't seen it yet. So... I can't wait till this Ender Pearl elevator gets in. It's gonna be so much quicker. We got a lot of shit to do, so I guess that's the stuff for you guys to look forward to. Awesome. So, Hold you know, on. guys, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, be sure to watch future episodes, I guess, if you find this interesting. And thanks a lot for watching. Peace. Bye bye. What the hell is going on?
And as you can see, we actually have free range test certificates now. You gotta make sure they gotta stretch their legs, get their exercise. I, mean, I don't like how it slows down there, I have to fix that. Fucking Enderman. This happens every time. He just ate through that. He just burnt. Oh my goodness. 